Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. This is going to be the sixth week of the total lockdown in the United Kingdom and much more longer in the rest of the world, resulting in total loss of our livelihood and freedom. It has major impact on our economical and social well-being. Vast majority of people have lost their job and employment. There are a lot of fear and anxiety going on among the public, resulting in severe damage to their well-being and family lives. Most of the business, small to large scale, have been collapsed. Schools are closed, affecting 1.8 million students in the world. People are not able to travel anywhere in the world, neither our loved, can, loved one can travel to the United Kingdom. The airports are shut, all the flights are grounded. Public transport, including trains, buses, are all seized off. There is a major impact to the economy of the United Kingdom and the rest of the world. At least 90% of the economy has been collapsed. Four million people have applied for unemployment in the United Kingdom. And 30 million people have applied for unemployment in the United States. The unemployment is much more worse in the progressing countries and the third world. There has been a Huge protest in the United States. The people have come out on the roads fighting for their fundamental rights and freedom. And there have been reports for the protest in different parts of the world as well. This is a time to come out to stand for your fundamental rights we need to show up unity and confidence on ourselves as a living nation we are very proud to be brave nation in the world and cannot see much more damages happening to the public 7.8 billion across the world this is a time to wake up and lead the world restore their fundamental rights watch your basic necessities Protect your nation against the agenda of vaccination, 5G technology, artificial intelligence and digital currency. The people of the United Kingdom are gathering in front of the Parliament House tomorrow, the 2nd of May, 2020. To show the solidarity and unity to fight for their fundamental and the birth rights to protect our generation and to eliminate poverty and restore the normal 
routine of life. You must join. And this is a time to wake up. And I will strongly request all of you to join us in front of the Parliament House tomorrow from 10 to 5 o'clock. Many thanks. Bye-bye.